Uh, I, I was sent this, I was gifted this uh, box, which is um, Munch Pack. And um, and anyway, I have this box and I wanted to open it with you guys just because I thought it would be really fun. Now, when the company reached out, they said, hey, can we send you this Munch Packs box? It looks amazing. And, and one thing I really love about it is the Easter Island head from the island of Rapa Nui. Uh, I really I really like that. I actually have a huge one of those on my balcony. It's like a big stone thing. It's amazing. Um, so I want to open this with you guys just so it would be fun, really. So I know that there's a bunch of snacks in here that are not vegan. So I think I think I know how to segregate them. I think. I don't know. Let's just go through it. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And let me... Sh so this is like snacks from around the world. This isn't just... This isn't just like UK snacks. just random snacks. These are like snacks from like Korea and Japan and different places. Okay, so... First thing we got here is watermelon slices, which are like gummies. Um, these actually have gelatin in them, so I can't eat these because that's not even vegetarian, let alone vegan. So yeah, not eating those. But they look good, don't they? They look really nice. Um, but maybe I'll give them to my son. Uh, or maybe not, actually. He's really young. Um, maybe I shouldn't be influencing him to eat sweets. <laughs> okay, next thing we have. They kind of look a little bit like pocky. Um, uh, let's have a look here now. This actually has milk in it, so I can't eat this either. Uh, contains milk, soy, and eggs. Okay, this is definitely not vegan, but they look really nice though. Um, and uh, yeah, they, they look nice. Okay, my son could probably have these. These are like pretzels with a bit of chocolate in them. That's kind of cool, I guess. Right. This is a mystery item. I, I don't even know what this is. There is like a booklet that came with this thing. So let me have a look, okay? Let me tell you what it is. Um, Okay, so these are called Crown Xing Zhang, which are sesame seed crisps, I guess. I, I don't know what these are. If anyone's had these, I don't know if these are vegan. Let's let's Google it, let's Google it together. What's it, what's it called? Crown? It's a pretty bizarre name, isn't it? Crown, like, okay, Crown. Uh, no way I live in Hollyhead, me first. <laughs> no, no, no. Crown Xing Zang. Okay, um, let's see if they're vegan or not. I don't know. These look really interesting, but I love stuff like this. I think these are Korean, I think. Yeah. That's what they look like. Um, vegan. Count for... They're not organic, so that doesn't really bother me, because um, it's snacks, you know, snacks are snacks. Uh, Product information. Okay, so let's see what's in it. Let's see what's in it. Okay. Oh, gosh. They don't look too yummy on the website. They look a bit gross. I'm not going to lie. They, these, these do not look good. Uh, product description. A sesame seed honey crunch crisp sweet honey glaze. Allergy information. May contain... Oh, this product is ready to eat. Oh, but it doesn't... Oh, so it's just mixed grains. There's no milk in it. Oh, so this this is vegan then. All right, let's try it. Um, oh my goodness. I can't even open this bloody packet. Hold on. <laughs> oh, man. oh my goodness. How are kids supposed to get into this? Okay. Oh, this does not smell good. I mean... Ah, no, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> this is not so good. I'm sorry, South Korea, but uh, who has ugh, sweet flavors? Okay, next up we have yummy gummy silly straws. These are fizzy straws from the lovely country of. Let's find out where these ones are from. These are from Turkey. So these are from Turkey, and these probably have gelatin in them as well. Let's have a look. Um, these have beef gelatin in them, so definitely not going to have these because they're not vegan. All right, some lovely paper that we got with this. Okay, what's this thing here now? This is a double Dutch honey vanilla. This sounds amazing. One cookie. So let's find out where this one is from. So this is one cookie from... Let's have a look now. 
Okay, well, it doesn't actually have... Oh, sorry, guys, these are South Korean as well. These these things are South Korean as well, just in case I, I didn't mention that. And the, um, the gummies are from Spain. The watermelon gummies are from Spain. So this... Hi, Alex. Uh, so this cookie doesn't even... It's not even on the... Why is this not on? I don't even know. This isn't on the box. So we're going to have to guess this is from... Oh, no, here it is. Canada. This is from Canada. Okay, cool. So that's Canada. That's not vegan either. All right then. This looks cool. What is this? Z Zaps potato chips. This is New Orleans kettle style evil eye potato chips. These, I'm guessing these are from America. I mean, I'm not going to um, hazard a guess. These are from the United States of America. Uh, a taste of New Orleans with Zap Zap's evil eye chips. The kettle cook gives these crisps perfect crunch. Every bite packs a double zap. Okay, see what's in these. Make sure they're vegan. Uh, there's hardly anything in these. Wow. And they're gluten free as well. Okay, cool. Right. All right, these are vegan. Let's do it. Oh man, they, they smell hot. These are the kind of thing that me and Alex buy when we're in America just to try out, because why not? Oh my goodness, look at this thing. Okay, here we go. That's all right. Just like Fritos. I mean, as far as crisps go, they're okay. Not as spicy as I wanted them to be. They're okay. Okay, nobody follow Alex. <laughs> he does have my home address though. Right, next up is these Chick Chack Everything Flavored Snacks. Everything Flavored Snacks from America. These are vegan. Oh, it's got American flag on the top of it, but it said product of Israel. All right, okay. So these are apparently every flavor. I don't see how that can be a thing. But these are from Israel. Um, a delicious, crunchy, salty, everything bagel inspired snack. These crunchy spirals pack a ton of flavor at every bite. Right? Let's go. Well, oh my goodness, they smell amazing. Oh, here we go. Oh my goodness. Wow. These taste like, I can't even, like, it's like having three different meals in one. Yes, I'm from Wales. I'm in Wales right now. Um, wow. It's just like a, a hot dog, falafel, pizza. I don't know. I mean, they're, they're really tasty. They, there is literally everything in that. Wow. All right. Still more snacks to go. Okay, here we go. So the next thing I'm pulling out is this thing from Thailand. This is called a Fruit Sea Extreme Z Blue Raspberry or Strawberry. So we got the strawberry one, I'm guessing. Um, this snack is not only kosher, but will also give you your taste buds a delicious sweet and sour kick. Uh, all right. I think this is vegan, actually. Let's have a look. Oh, ingredients. Wheat flour, glucose syrup, strawberry flavoring, pineapple juice, and flavorings. Cool. All right. Let's give it a spin. Ooh. Wow, this thing even smells, um, sorry, I didn't mean to make anyone hungry. This thing even smells sour. See, I don't really eat sweets like this. I only really eat sweets when I'm, when I'm with Alex. Alex is a bad um, influence on me. Okay, so this is a piece of it. We actually call these things Astro Belts in the UK if it's the same thing. So I'm going to try it. Mmm. Wow. That's really nice. Yeah. All right, Thailand, you win. Guys, I'm making everyone hungry. You guys can check out Munch, um, Munchpack yourself. Um, just go to Munchpack, uh, the website is munchpack.com, I think. Um, wow, the website isn't on the box. 
that's not a good sign. Uh, this took forever to come though, but oh, there's a competition. Enter to win a free family pack. One, take take a picture, share on social media, and use hashtag MunchPack. There you go. Okay, moving on, everyone. Hey, Nev Olive, two thousand and nine. What's going on? My best friend Alex isn't a bad influence with sweets. I am. <laughs> no, my friend Alex definitely. Hi Dan, can you say hi to me? Miss Haley Murray. Hey Haley Murray, how's it going? Right. This thing's opened. I don't even know if it's it's vegan or not. Let's just check. Um, this is the problem with being vegan, I guess. This is a Neapol Neapolitan cookies. Uh, vanilla chocolate cookie sandwiches. Delicious strawberry. Okay. So these are Neapolitan and I'm going to check for milk. Ingredients. Ingredients in English, maybe? Oh, here we go. Flour, riven flavor, sugar, soy. No way. No way. It, it, these are vegan. All right. Uh, yes, Naomi is vegan too. We're, we're, we're both vegan here. Our little boy is vegetarian. Though. He, he's not. He's not a vegan. Just me and Naomi are vegan. Right. Whoa. This thing packs a punch. Look at this. This is like, looks like a ninja turtle <laughs> on one side of it, <laughs> and then another one on the other side of it. Um, this is strawberry, vanilla, and chocolate. Let's try it. All right, where are these from? These are from Costa Rica. Um, wow. This is the most sugary biscuit I've ever tasted in my life. Oh my goodness. It's nice, but too much. What made your little boy vegan? Nothing, he's vegetarian. My little boy is almost two and he's vegetarian. But me and my partner, his mum, well, we're vegan. Um, okay, so, oh, the last thing in here now. I don't know if I'll be able to have this, but I'll open it and show you guys. Okay. The last one here is from South Korea again. Uh, this is Crow My Chew Apple. My Chew. Uh, I can't even read this. Oh, crud. All right, let me have a look. C Crown My Chew Apple. Let's have a look if these, these are vegan. Crown. Uh, let's have a look. Ah, okay. Crown My Chew Vegan. Let's have a look. It's 5.30 a.m. in California. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. Me wrecking your head like, oh, wake up. <laughs> Me trying to snatch from around the world, which I can't even try because I'm vegan. Um, ingredients. Pork gelatin. Let's have a look. Oh no, that's not the, that's not the, that's not the one. Okay. Okay, so this is, this is the apple one. So the Apple One's ingredients are, oh my goodness, this thing has yogurt in it. It's milk, citric acid, um, but it doesn't have gelatin in it, which is a good thing, I suppose, but this actually does have, uh, this has, this one has milk in it. So, can't have these, but I'm gonna enjoy the rest of the snacks that I can eat. Um, and uh, yeah, I think that's it. But that was everything in the box. So let's have a look at it. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten items in this box. And the this box is pretty smart. Like it was rammed with, with stuff. It's a very good presentation. I really enjoyed it. And it was really nice of them to send me this, you know, um, hashtag gifted. I didn't buy it, but they sent it to me. Um, and I really enjoyed it. I wish I could eat these because I used to love like sweets like this. Um, this looks incredible. These look really good, but obviously you can't have them because they're not vegan. This, um, these look really good, but again, not vegan. Koreans, number one band. Cool. I meant Korea's a number one brand. I said band because I'm a bit of an idiot. Um, and then these were pretty gross. They're like, um, they're like, I don't know what to describe. It was like a little, it was like a honey flavored crisp. Like if you're gonna eat crisps, you don't eat honey flavored crisps. What do Americans call them? Um, Potato chips. You wouldn't eat 
honey flavored potato chips, would you? Which is a bit weird. So not even my dog liked it. I gave I gave my one to my dog and he just he just like was like, nah, I'm not having that dad. These look outstanding. But can't have these. Cause they ain't vegan. So what else have we got? This thing is just fantastic. Um these are good. Uh, this is also really yummy, um, and then these are these are these are pretty good as well. So I'm gonna go upstairs now and let Naomi try them, um, see if she wants to to eat them. And that being said, guys, that is the end of me trying all this stuff. Just an update for you guys: the Tamagotchi we're on day nine, and it's it's looking dope. I have to have dairy-free products because I have gluten and dairy intolerances, so my family usually just get vegan cheese and it's good. Vegan cheese is awesome. Yeah, I've been vegan. I, I started, I, I turned vegan in October and then I went back to vegetarian for December because it was just too difficult with like Christmas and stuff and I wasn't as prepared as I am now. And then on January the 1st, I became vegan again. So I've been vegan since, strict vegan since January the 1st and that includes ethical veganism. So I don't like buy leather and I don't, um, you know, I don't support animal cruelty and all that ah. stuff. So yeah, my goodness, my dog is just a totally crazy Google boy. So, all right.